In this video, we're going to discuss attributional processes, focusing on the self-serving bias and fundamental attribution error. To begin, attribution is the process by which individuals explain the causes of behavior and events. Generally, there are two types of explanations that individuals will use, internal factors and external factors. Internal factors would be using characteristics of the individual. So the person could be smart, they could be hardworking, or they could be lazy. External factors are factors that are external to the individual and outside the control of the individual. Let's take a look at self-serving bias. Self-serving bias occurs when an individual alters the perception of causality to preserve self-esteem. So self-esteem is the key aspect here. The explanation that this individual is going to use to explain behavior and events is with the purpose of preserving self-esteem. So an easy way of thinking about this is when something good happens, the individual is going to take credit for it and use internal factors to explain the success. And when something bad happens, the individual is going to use external factors to explain it. So that way, even though they failed, it's not their fault. It's some external factor that caused the failure. Here, we have one example where students were asked to play the role of a teacher and teach students basic arithmetic. When students learn well, the teachers would accept responsibility for their improvement. And they would say things like, oh, I'm such a good teacher. That's why the students were able to learn. However, when the students did not learn well, the teachers would blame the students for the low performance. So for this failure, they would not take the blame themselves. They would say, oh, the reason why the students didn't learn well is because the student is not a good student. So you can see here in both cases, whether the students did well or not, the teacher responded in such a way as to preserve self-esteem. Next, we have fundamental attribution error. Fundamental attribution error occurs when an individual attributes another person's behavior using the person's internal characteristics as opposed to external factors. So as compared with self-serving bias, fundamental attribution error doesn't have anything to do with preserving self-esteem. It's essentially just saying, when you look at other individuals, you explain their behaviors using internal characteristics as opposed to external factors. So for example, if a person is late to a meeting, then they must be an inconsiderate person. All right, the inconsiderate part is an internal factor. That's why they were late to the meeting. However, this fundamental attribution error does not consider the possibility of external factors resulting in the person being late. For instance, maybe traffic was really bad that day and that was out of the control of that individual. But no, under fundamental attribution error, you do not consider external factors. So you would use an internal factor, like the person must be inconsiderate. Another example is, if you see someone donate money, then you must think that they are very generous. So again, you are explaining the behavior using the person's internal characteristics. And an external factor that might actually be the case is maybe the person feels peer pressure to donate. So if you're in a group with many others, if everyone else is donating, you might feel obligated to donate as well. It's not that you're actually a generous person, but because everyone around you is donating, you feel like you must donate as well. Okay, so that's self-serving bias and fundamental attribution error.